Yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to another Final Fantasy VIII tutorial on the channel. Today we're going to complete the CC group side quest and get our hands on three awesome new rare cards. Completing this quest also allows for some very powerful stat boosting much later in the game so we really want to make sure we complete this quest. The CC group are a club of card players located in Balam Garden that can be challenged in disc 2 after the garden becomes mobile. You will only be able to challenge the CC group once you've won 15 games of cards in the Balam region and the quest cannot be completed until after the story events at Fisherman's Horizon, so you best to wait until then. The CC group consists of seven players, starting with the first player, Jack. No, wrong Jack. Oh. Make your way to the directory and look for this guy walking around. You can't miss him. Although none of the CC group members are very good at triple triad, Jack is considered the easiest. So challenge and beat him. Then we move on to number two, Club. Head to the area of garden that contains the entrance to the cafeteria, the dormitory, and the parking lot. We're looking for a guy in a siege uniform. And like Jack, club is particularly easy. So challenge and beat him and move on to number three, Diamond. Card Princess Diamond, aka the Diamond Duo, are the twins found in front of the directory. You can challenge either one since they play as a duo, but once again, they're pretty easy, but they also have some high level boss cards that you may want to spend some time collecting here. I won't judge. Once you beat the two of them, this is the point where you won't be able to progress the quest until after Fisherman's Horizon. But next up is Card Prince Spade. Located on the second floor hallway, this is the guy that gave you your first seven cards at the very beginning of the game. He's also another easy victim to your deadly triple triad addiction. And if he isn't here, just run to the left and come back until he appears. Took me a few tries, so don't be alarmed if he doesn't show right away. And finally, the last of the four suits, Card Queen Heart. Head on up to the third floor and challenge this all too familiar seed. Card Queen Heart is the first to have a rare card, which is Carbuncle. You may need to play her multiple times until you obtain it, but make sure you do. Now, all that's left is the Card King and a Mystery CC group member. We'll start with the Mystery member, also known as joker he's located in the training center through the right door he'll be standing on the platform in the middle so like spade if he isn't there just exit and re-enter the room until he shows up attempt to challenge him multiple times as the first time he'll just try and sell you stuff when you beat joker he also updates your battle meter to display gf information which is a cool touch joker also has the leviathan card so make sure you collect that from him but now last but not least the card king it's Quistus. It's Quistus. Make your way to the infirmary and attempt to play cards with the doctor to open up a bit of dialogue. She'll mention that she used to be the card king, but lost the title to another girl years ago. Head into your dorm room, make a save, and rest in your bed over and over until the king appears. Quistus has the Gilgamesh card on her, so make sure you win that. If she doesn't play the card, then you can challenge her again up on the cockpit on the third floor. Once you beat her, that's the whole quest done. So pat yourself on the back. If this guide helped you out at all, then please leave a like and if you feel like it, drop a comment. Your likes and comments help the channel so much, so I really appreciate it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for more Final Fantasy tutorials and tips and tricks. We're going to be covering a ton of Final Fantasy 16 when that comes out, so stay tuned for that. Anyway, my name's been Tom, you guys have been awesome, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace.